Good morning guys, how are you doing? Hope you're all fit and well, hope you're all staying indoors. So, my name is Alex Rosser, I'm an S14 para swimmer who represented Wales at the Commonwealth Games in 2018, where I finished 6th uh, in the final, the S14 200m freestyle. I'm also um, a Team Wales athlete and also a Swim Wales athlete as well. So today I'm going to be showing you some of the things I've been doing in lockdown to adapt my training and to also make sure that I stay as fit as possible and as strong as possible. So once lockdown ends I can return to the pool as safely as I can and also be as fit as I can so I can build up onto my success and look forward to the Paralympics and also Birmingham Commonwealth Games in 2022. So yeah, let's go. The first thing we're going to do is we're just going to mobilise the spine by using what's called a foam roller. So what we do, we pop the foam roller under our shoulder blades, we grab both our hands, we put our hands behind our head, and then all we do, keeping our hips on the floor, is press our shoulder blades together, lean back, and we're just going to gently clip the spine. We do this, we generally move up the back, so we're getting those vertebrae nice and loose. So, now we've got our vertebrae nice and loose, we're now going to move into some yoga pose called the cat and the cow. So for this, we put our hands on all fours, we make sure our hips our knees are in line, we lean forward, and what we want to do is push our hands into the floor, round our spine up, round our spine, and then when we're ready, we slowly unhinge our spine vertebrae by vertebrae, making sure we're pushing our shoulder blades together and looking forward. The importance of this is to make sure that spine movement is as loose as possible. So when I'm in the water swimming, I want to make sure I have a nice loose spine so I'm able to do butterfly kick correctly. It's now 10.30 in the morning and I'm just about to move on to my, uh, my morning cardio. So I've currently got an exercise bike set, uh, set up in my garage. Um, I've got a rolling road on it so it stays on the spot. Um, you can do this anywhere if you've got a bike out on the street, out on a cycle path, out of the way. Um, so yeah. Afternoon guys, it's just now gone 12.30 p.m. and um, one of the biggest things I've um, I've looked to get, obviously like a swimming's um, mainly a water-based sport, so you can't really do any swimming unless you've got any water. So one of the things that I come up with was investing in a, what's called a tic tac pool. This is a, a pool that's currently about uh, this is about three meters, about seventy uh, meters deep, and uh, we're going to do some swimming in it. So wish me luck. How are you doing guys just finished my swim for the morning um i typically swim about twice a day for about four minutes at a time just to keep that some feel around my fingers in the water so when i go back now to training hopefully as soon as possible <laughs> um it won't be as difficult it'll be a lot a lot easier to slip in and also incorporating the biking sessions as well as additional i also do additional strength work as well in the gym um, I'm, I'm very fortunate enough to have um, a home gym facility so hopefully by doing all this it'll help me to slip back into routine a lot easier and quicker as well. Afternoon guys it's now two o'clock so one of the things that I do um, I've been doing since during lockdown is I've been delivering food shopping out to the elderly who um, 
obviously where I'm from they can't um, they can't come out of their house and they're on um, 12 week lockdown so we just try and do what we can Let's just try and deliver as many as we can so yeah right it's now I think it's 8 o'clock now um, so decided to get my actual hour of exercise a day when I'm allowed out of the house um, pretty much to highlight my day really um, I go for a walk up the mountain with my partner and we go and feed horses so yeah pretty much good and the view is absolutely spectacular so just bear that in mind guys make sure when you go out you're away from everyone you're only going out for an hour a day and if you're not out exercising or like shopping stay indoors stay safe okay and well hopefully we'll get back to reality sooner than later right cheers guys